hey y'all what is up okay it has been a hot minute since i have done a vlog i've been so busy um mostly i've just been taking care of myself mentally i've been hanging out with my friends i've just been trying not to really focus too much on recording everything but like trying to like live in the moment you know um but this weekend you know i kind of want to record something that's going on because um i've that's another thing why I haven't been vlogging is because I've been training so in October I signed up for a Disney run which is the princess one and it's been on my bucket list for the longest time and I was finally able to sign up for one unfortunately they didn't have a 5k one or a 10k so I signed up for a half marathon <laughs> I mean it's not really as much but it's still a lot for me being my first time and um yeah, it's actually in, on Sunday, so it's going to be in three days. So, um, right now, I'm going to be on my way to the expo. Um, they're going to have a Disney Run Expo, and that's where we have to go and pick up, um, like, our numbers, you know, our t-shirts that they're going to give us, our goodie bag and all that. Because, by the way, I took my biology exam this morning, and I got a 95. I thought I was going to fail that shit. But anyways, I passed it. And so it's been a good day and not just that but my family's coming into town today um my mom my brother my cousin my nieces and nephews you know everyone's coming in today so i'm gonna go to the expo and then i'm gonna go pick them up at the airport and then we're all gonna go to the hotel um i might take them to like cast connections you know disney springs and all that but yeah guys it's gonna be a great weekend um something that's kind of bummy so like i've been really enjoying running um it's been helping me out a lot mentally and physically and because i've i've been loving running so much i've made it such a habit to run every single day and um it was it's good <coughs> but it's also bad because i never gave myself a day off every morning like every night the what i would look forward to was my runs in the morning and because I've been running so much, um, I started getting shin splints really bad. Um, I just started getting them this week, and of course I got them the week of the marathon. So um, I've kind of been resting up this week. Um, I'm really hoping everything goes well for the marathon because I know you need to like, it takes like four weeks to recover a shin split, but hunger got three days. So I'm here for a good time, not a long time. I paid a lot of money for this marathon, so you know what? Why not mess up my leg even more now, right? So, yeah, um, you know what? Let's see how this weekend goes. I'm excited for this marathon. I'm excited to wear my costume that I'm going to wear for this marathon. But, yeah, guys, let's get started. Let's go to ESPN Wide World of Sports, um, which is also another location that I'm working at now. Um, but, yeah, let's go and pick up my stuff. And, yeah, let's get this day started. Or let's get this weekend started, y'all. Okay guys, so I picked up my bib and now I'm gonna go pick up my t-shirt. <laughs> guys, we're here and I'm so excited. <laughs> Just picked up my t-shirt and I am in love. It's a yellow t-shirt and it has Cinderella on it. It's so pretty. I'm surprised it's not long sleeve, it's actually a short sleeve and I'm surprised it didn't come in blue instead it came in yellow which is my favorite color. Um, so yeah, we're just chilling right now, I'm just exploring the expo all by myself. Okay guys, so I told y'all about my shin splits and how they were getting bad. So I ended up getting taped, they have like a whole bunch of cool things here, like for free. Like I got taped up for free. Um, so and i'm just like kind of testing out the tapes right now because i actually do want to buy some because homegirl doesn't want to die during the expo so we'll see how this goes we're just walking around just seeing what else there is around the expo guys look at the medal i'm gonna be getting on sunday ah, i'm so excited a portrait so he has a portrait maker on the game and Okay, you okay, Matthew? Oh, I'm great. Oh, okay. Yeah. Maybe <laughs> <laughs> 
No, we've try tried. one. I mean, one we haven't tried. tried. And it's kind of hard. Uh, you just kind of go for it. Yeah, because it's easy. Yeah, you know. Huh? Do it again? One more time, Charlie. My head. Two more times. Uh, <laughs> you put, yeah. no, you put yes. one heel in. And then yes. you go back and forth. Oh, we and love that. Back here because the oh, Okay, y'all. So, um. I just got back from the expo. Okay, so the plan was to go from the expo straight to the airport, but um, my family's, um, the flight ended up getting delayed and I forgot my extra GoPro battery. So I was just like, you know what, I'm gonna just go back home, pick up some stuff and gave y'all a good, you know, haul of the things that I got. Oh my goodness. <sighs> it was amazing. And I don't know if I told you guys, but, um, I think I did. I mentioned in the video that um, my legs were starting to hurt, and I think it was like shin splints and like calf muscles, and like I was just having a lot of pain. And there was um, the stand for the KT tape, and they ended up taping me like for free. Like there was like so many cool things going on. They ended up taping me, and y'all like homegirls been like walking or whatever. Like yes, yes, yes. Yes, okay, so yeah, I feel better. Um, but yeah, I ended up buying some KT tape. Okay, guys, so keep in mind, I only got a few things. I got things that um, I wanted to get now and, like, things that I knew would not make it to Cast Connections. Cast Connections, it's, like, a warehouse that they have for employees only where they send out, you know, some of their merchandise, like, for cheaper, you know? And they always end up sending, like, everything from the marathon. So I was like, I know they're going to be sending down pens, they're going to be sending down the ornaments, the keychains, all that stuff, the cups, the wine cups. And I was just like, I'll just buy all of that there, but I'm going to get things that I know, like, don't ever make it there. So, um, this shirt, I mean, even though it might make it, I don't know, but I got it from my mom. Um, it says, my favorite Disney princess is my daughter, and it says Disney Princess Half Marathon Weekend. Um, and then I also got this Run Disney t-shirt. I don't know why, but, like, I tried it on, like, in front of everybody. And, like, I had, like, five people come up to me saying, that looks amazing on you. The color looks great. I sent it in my group chat with my friends. Anyway, shout out to my babies, my creativities. Um, I sent it to them, and they were like, yes, get this one, get this one. And I was sending, like, other sweaters, too, and they were like, no, like, get the purple one. And what's so cute about the purple one let me show you guys like it says all this like it has like a checklist and i was like damn i was like you already know i'm eat all the carbs right after I'm so excited to wear this one um i actually bought this one i don't know why but i've been like about i don't know what's up with me in hats lately um i didn't ever really wear hats but now that i lost so much weight like i i like wearing hats now because like my face looks actually okay and and like um so yeah, I was just like, you know what, this is so cute. And it has like the princesses that are like the theme of, of the um, each event. And then um, it's like so glittery, surprisingly. Let me see if the, no, the glitter doesn't even, yeah, no glitter falls off. That's amazing. It says, I don't sweat, I sparkle. Oh, we love it. This t-shirt came with my package for um, the Disney Marathon. So yeah, guys, there's my haul for the day. Um, in just a bit, I'm about to go pick up my fam bam up from the airport. Um yeah it's gonna be a good weekend guys i'm so excited here goes my crazy ass family la familia peluche <laughs> okay guys so it is currently 3 28 right now i am on my way to epcot because that's where um <coughs> the half marathon's gonna start at so it's gonna start at Epcot and then we're gonna run all the way to Magic Kingdom and then back to Epcot. So yeah, but like check-in is at 4.30. The reason why I'm going so early is because so many people are gonna be doing the marathon and um, I just don't wanna deal with traffic. Y'all, it's so cold. So like the plan was to just wear a sports bra and a tutu. Now I'm just like, yeah, no, I think I'm gonna just wear my sports bra and my sweater but no tutu. I'll probably just wear like my stash. I don't know, I'm thinking about it. We'll see in the end of this video what I did end up wearing. Yeah, my shin splints, they're still pretty bad. Don't wanna really push it too much today. So I'ma just like try to run as much as I can, but like once I start feeling pain, I'ma, cause homegirl's not trying to push it, okay? Okay guys, so I just got here and thankfully I came an hour early. Um, the route to usually come to Epcot 
um, was changed up because of the race that was set up already. So there were like literally like signs like pointing me in all like kinds of directions. Luckily they had like signs like telling you like where to go. But overall, like it's not like the usual way to get there. So I had to take a whole different route. And yeah, so now I'm finally here. Um I see a lot of people. Yo, it is mad cold. I don't know. Oh my gosh, like seeing these these people don't have jackets on. Oh my gosh, I'm too Mexican for this, y'all. Like, oh my gosh, this lady is literally just wearing a bra and shorts. Y'all, this is ridiculous. Alright, guys, well, um, yeah, well, let's start checking in and stuff. I'm debating on whether I want to be crazy like them, but do I want to be crazy like them? Do I want to be crazy like them? Do I want to be crazy? <laughs> Okay, guys, so we're currently walking over to the start line. Ah. Okay, honestly, I'm kind of not even regretting not wearing my tutu because it was so big and a lot of people are wearing their tutus. Everyone's literally so cozied up because it's so freaking cold, guys. It's so cold. Okay, guys, so it's, it's like hitting me that I'm about to run this marathon and I'm literally about to cry. I'm literally about to cry right now. We're about to make it to the castle. <laughs> Guys, we're running to the Magic Kingdom. It's all of the same map. The fact that we're not allowed to run at the parks, this is the perfect time to actually get to run through the parks. <laughs> Guys, we're about to start running through the castle. Okay guys, so this is a princess you cannot forget about. I'm so gonna do another big soon. Okay guys, so you would think I'd be tired and exhausted and dying. It possibly will can, but can't even tell because I'm having this time with my life right now. This is like the best day ever. <laughs> Guys, the 10 mile mark is my favorite one. They finally have Miguel from Coco. Guys, we're back at Epcot. <laughs> Guys, it's been a blast. I have two more miles to go and then we'll be done with the marathon with the half marathon. Alright guys, we're almost done. We only have one mile left. We're almost to the finish line. Alright guys, so I've been meeting a lot of characters. I haven't been recording all of them, but I've been recording most of them. So at this one we have full. I've only been stopping at rare characters, so like characters that I know that I'll see at the park, I usually skip them. But the ones that like I've never seen before, I usually stop for those. Guys, I finally got my medal! Yo, I'm literally gonna sit down and take a break because homegirl is tired. I'm literally tired, 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 tired. Okay guys, so I just ate the food that they gave us because homegirl was a, not was like about to pass out, but honestly like it's so sunny outside and I just really needed to like fuel up on energy to like be able to walk around and stuff. Um, so yeah, y'all, my medal, it is so gorgeous. She's a beauty, she a baddie. Um, so yeah, 
I'm kind of done for the day. I'm just gonna go home now. Maybe I might go to the parks later. I don't know, I'm thinking about it, but we'll see, we'll see. But other than that, I'm definitely gonna do another marathon soon. It was just the greatest experience of my life and it was the best freaking day ever. Like, this isn't gonna be the last time I'm doing this. Y'all have to do this, it is the best. All right, guys, look at my reward. I got chocolate chip pancakes, chocolate chip banana pancakes at Kiki's, and tomatoes with egg.